Video games as a whole are fairly predictable. They're divided into various genres and all tend to fall back on established conventions and mechanics. Every so often though, there comes a game that breaks through the mold, a game that is wholly unique in and of itself. These games, whether it be through some feature or premise, aren't closely replicated by similar titles. What's rarest of all, however, is a game that challenges the very notion of what makes a game exactly that. What's up guys, this is Zach with Attack Gaming and today we're taking a look at Cloud Chamber. Cloud Chamber, labeled as a massively multiplayer story game, is one such title. Developed by Investigate North, Cloud Chamber is one of the most innovative products to come out of the gaming industry in quite some time, although at times it may be a bit too innovative for its own good. Like Gone Home and Dear Esther before it, Cloud Chamber provides a certain experience to the player through the video gaming medium. But is it a video game, a movie, a work of art? Can it be all of those things? Does it even really matter what it is as long as you're enjoying the product? Cloud Chamber tells the story of a discovery of a signal from another world and the ramifications it entails. Unlike traditional story-based games, there's no linear progression from point A to point B. Cloud Chamber is essentially an interactive database filled with movie clips, files, images, and transcripts. Viewing the various files bit by bit, you begin to piece together exactly what turns out to be quite an intriguing story, and that's basically the extent of actual gameplay. Now, keep in mind, this game is massively multiplayer. Each bit of evidence you uncover throughout your journey is attached to a discussion board where you can share ideas and theories with other players. Contribute enough, and you can eventually unlock additional data, which further clarifies the story. In that sense, the game is not necessarily the coded mechanics, admittedly of which there are extremely few. The game is interacting with your peers, researching ideas, and drawing conclusions based on the clues you're provided. As quirky as all that sounds, it's fairly easy to become absolutely engrossed in this game and all it has to offer. Possibly my favorite aspect of the game are the live action cutscenes. If you love the old school Sega CD FMV games, you will love Cloud Chamber. Of course, that's not to say the acting is bad or the video quality is low. Video quality is great and the acting is actually well done. Videos will alternate between journal entries, which are generally monologues featuring specific characters, or conversations between two. Other videos show recorded scenes or events that last upwards of 10 minutes to 10 seconds. You'll find yourself watching these over and over and over again, analyzing every frame, looking for something that you may have missed the first time around that can totally change your opinion of the entire story. Ultimately though, Cloud Chamber is only as good as the work you're willing to put into it. It's a bit too easy just to watch all the videos and breeze through the documentation to get to the end without contributing anything at all to the community. In doing that, the game is little more than a series of well-produced YouTube videos. Also, I feel like the contribution system can be abused. Your ability to access certain files depends entirely on how many likes you may receive from a particular post. It seems too easy to have a few friends upvote all your posts to unlock content. Still, if you're the type of person who enjoys the metagame of community discussions surrounding the content in-game, Cloud Chamber is an experience unlike anything you've seen before and is well worth your time and money. If you're interested in learning more about the game, head over to its official website at cloudchambermystery.com or check out the game on Steam. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button, comment, and subscribe to our channel for more gaming news, first impressions, giveaways, and other general randomness.